Another thing. What the fuck is this? Why are this gonna drizzle when the sky does Oh, what the hell. Yeah, it's saying it's drizzling in Edmonton. That ain't true at all. It is not true. It's bullshit. Why would they say it's drizzling? And it's saying that there's gonna be thunderstorm and stuff. But... Wait a second. If I'm thinking about this and I just see Calgary being shot by all these beams and it's all coming towards Edmonton, that would mean it's fucking man-made. I mean, look at this. Chance of thunder and shower. Monday evening. Thunder and shower. Cloud and shower. Cloud and shower. Cloud and shower. This has been predicted for like a week it been it's like the fourth day that I'm seeing sun in the sky so this is not normal folks why would they be saying that this is happening when I'm looking at the radar and everything's fine it's not drizzling it is not the weather network is lying it is fucking lying and it's pissing me off. Let's take a quick look at the radar here. Mm, a little thing right here. It's probably created by Harp. Just look at the clouds. I'm living right where there's that red thing. That's where I live. Do you see any precipitation? Except this harp anomaly that is there every single day. No. If I remove the cloud, come on. If I remove the cloud, and we look over here in Calgary, they're shooting beams over there. And look how it's forming. And this is going to come towards me. So tonight, I'm going to make a video about that crap that is coming towards me that just appears from nowhere. You can't see it. It just appears from nowhere. See? And you can actually see a square here, like a, a line right next to McLeod. See? There's like a line there. So, this is man-made. If it was natural, it would come from over here. It would go through the mountains, get more powerful. Then it would come on top of my head. Or it would come from Montana and it would go up to me. It wouldn't just show up from nowhere like it's doing right now. Da, 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 da. I am showing up from nowhere. I'm going to be filming today. I need to see those clouds just show up. But interesting thing is you see these beam Calgary is doing. They're shooting at that precipitation place over there. It's always red. Same as over here. <coughs> yeah, over here. It's always there. It's not moving. It's always red or yellow. I guess they're using this to create storm. This is just my guess. Um, over here, on I seen on top of Springfield, if I can find Springfield. I don't live in the state, so... <laughs> oh, yeah, it's right around here. Uh, Alright, so in San Luis, we've got beams that are shooting right at the storm. You can see another beam going towards Illinois. So my guess is, this will go through Illinois and in Indiana. And uh, here, 
Where was it? Um, there's just strings everywhere. There's one there. There's one there. There's a big one there. Oh, yeah. Right on top of Springfield. Springfield's right here in misery. It's a big circle just coming from Springfield. And making that rotate around so it can hit the other rings. So it's going to travel south. And it's going to probably go through Tennessee and then go up again. Why do I say it's going to go up again? Because just how the system usually goes. It goes down and it goes up through California, uh, Carolina, I mean. And it keeps going up and up and up and up till it reaches New Brunswick. <coughs> I know I used to live there and I used to watch the storm every time there was one. Travel all the way up and hit us. But it's usually weak when it gets there. So it's nothing to worry about. And over here, I find this kind of odd. Because it's going down. See how it's going down? Personally, in my life, I never actually noticed that. They usually always go up. Like next to the Gulf of uh, Maine and stuff. And all over here. That's where the storm usually travels. Through Pennsylvania and blah, blah, blah. But anyway, for you guys over here in Illinois, Indiana, and Kentucky, Tennessee too. Bad weather for you guys today. And tomorrow probably. And for me? Well, for me, I think this is bullshit. And uh, I will be filming that bullshit. So have a good day, guys. Enjoy your little bit of sun while you still got some.